Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. So, um, for those of you who know, I'm basically changing base from Birmingham to Manchester. So I'm going to film like a um, moving vlog. So this is like day one of my moving vlog. Mikey is in a mood this morning because he doesn't like to get up. Because basically I've just done four late flights and then in between the flights we've had to pack. So we've had to do all of, all of this really late. So he's in the mood. Massive mood, just sulking on the bed. Oh yeah. Thank you. <laughs> he's in the mood. He's not very nice in the mornings, so he needs to become a morning person. Stop. So basically we're just waiting for my mum and Stan to come here now. And then we're going to take all the big stuff back to Wales because um, I'm going to stay at home for a bit because it's only like an hour to travel, so I'll just travel for now. And then obviously once we find our new place, then I'll have to move again. So all the big stuff going today and then we have literally like eight days and then on the 18th we have to give the keys back. So then all the stuff that will be here will be the stuff that we need for the hotel. So yeah, today's a very busy day and everyone's tired and cranky. My mum's probably stressed as well because she did, she doesn't know how to like navigate to get here. She said she was supposed to be here at 9 and now she's getting here at 10, so we'll see. So yeah, I'll keep you all updated. Oi. Do you know what today is? What? A day of annoying you. Yeah. Do you want to finish then? What? Yes, I went over it. <coughs> Just fell over my balloon to your girl. Yo! Hey, Shiba! Oh. oh. <laughs> so yeah, this is how it's going. They've arrived. Say hi. Hi. <laughs> this is our update. Left the drawers for two seconds. Someone pushed them over and now they're all broken. Now they go in the bin. Don't you love it here? Okay, so guys, now arrived. We're back in Wales. So we're just going to unload all the stuff and then we need to go back so yeah i am tired because it took us like over three hours to get here because traffic but it's gonna be a busy day this is my family <laughs> Hi, <Liz. laughs> these people okay guys so this is an update with my moving vlog so it's now sunday the 17th of october so today is the day that we need to like clean everything put it back where it is as you can see i've started to do that all my stuff has officially moved out now and um, we just need to take like a few of these boxes down so yeah um i was quite upset today actually i had a massive mental breakdown because i was on an early standby and i really needed this standby just to you know clean this apartment get everything out because we're going to the hotel tonight and that's going to be for 11 nights so it was going to be quite a busy day and then crew control called me and I had to go for a flight. So I was like, okay, it won't be that bad. But then to make matters worse, it wasn't even an early flight. It was a mid flight. So it was meant to be a four sector on late, but I was only an hour to do the first sector. And I've literally only just landed now at like half five. So that was kind of annoying. So yeah, tonight's stressful. So I can't do any uni work tonight. But for the next 11 nights, we're going to be staying in like this Airbnb. So it's kind of like a house share thing because I thought like if we go to Premier Inn, we can't wash our clothes or even cook tea. So we're going to the Airbnb instead, which will be better because then we can like wash our clothes and like cook and things. So yeah, this is the update. And um, we're just going to sort this apartment now and then we're going to go straight there. But yeah. And then tomorrow, um, I'm going to hand back the keys. So obviously, because I'm in Selfridges tomorrow, tonight's the only time I can do this. And I can't believe I had this massive mental breakdown. Like literally crew control called me. And then straight after being on the phone with them, I started crying. And that is the type of levelness of stress we're at at this point. I started crying because i got called for a vlog hey guys this is just an update to my vlog also how cute are these pajamas <gasps> they are literally like the new winnie the pooh christmas collection oh my god i'm obsessed and also 
I have a new member to my family. Oh, I love her so much. So cute. So I've got Stitch, Angel and Winnie now. But yeah, so um, obviously we've been staying in this Airbnb. It is literally like, oh, it's cramped in here. Like, as you can see, everything is a mess. So I've been living in this like room for like the past week. It's been all right, don't get me wrong, but like I just can't wait to like just go home now because I'm getting sick of this, like having all my stuff everywhere. Um, but yeah, it is now Tuesday and it is the 26th of October, so not long left. I did late faro last night and I've got my last flight on the 30th, which isn't early, big gosh, not it. I'm done but I'm really excited because we've got like this massive um Halloween event on Thursday night so we're going to Basildon which is like near London and it's going to be hosted by Nathan and Grace so that'll be excited so I will vlog all of that. But guys it is now um Thursday we're moving out of the Airbnb like my car is full of stuff but today is such a mad rush like I need a red balloon for my Halloween costume with helium in it Brad and Abby are getting here for 11 and then I've got a friend coming at half 10. So yeah, it's a busy day. Okay, so I've sorted the balloon and this is a little hint of what I'm going to be. Um, Mike also has a paper boat, so maybe that will give it away. Um, I've just met Matt as well. He's the first officer at my base and they run this advent calendar business um, on Etsy. So he just gave me this to do some PR for him. Uh, look how cute the packaging is. Oh my God, it's getting me excited for Christmas. Like, look, look at the little robe. Oh, Christmas vibes. I love it. So yeah, we're now going to go back to the apartment because we're going to leave our cars there. Naughty, but we know the code to the car park and we'd rather have the cars be safe. Because basically when we go to Basildon, um, we're traveling down with Brad and Abby because they're coming with us. So... Well, we're obviously just going to go in one car, so me and Mike are just going to leave our cars up where we used to live, but it's fine, like, there's no cameras or anything. Um, and yeah, and then we're going to go on our way and go get our makeup done. So just got to the hotel now, and as you can see, like, everything is a mess, but how good is my makeup? Like, she has done an amazing job, but like, I'm so happy. It's makeup by Liv Summer, in case you're wondering. Oh, it looks super cute. I still haven't decided on my hair. Like, because my pieces here are really long now, they're like flicking out, but I kind of like the vibe, so I might just keep it. But yeah, I'm going to get ready now. This is my outfit. Honestly, I am in love. I like, even got the blue. How cute is this outfit? Oh, love it. And then I'll show you in here as well. And yeah, this is everyone's outfit. So, Hi. you got Angel, Brad's. Just got contact lenses in. <laughs> and then you got George, Mikey, George. who is Georgie to match with me. But yeah, we're all excited and we're going now. <laughs> this is my YouTube channel. <laughs> so, guys, this is Scott. He's from Stansen. Leah. And then I actually And then Jim. 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 Day. um the event last night was actually really good um had a really good time actually um so it is now a friday um and we're in a different hotel now we're now in the arden hotel for the next two nights which is literally right next to the airport so it's really handy because i've got my last flight operating out of birmingham tomorrow and then that's my birmingham days over so then on Sunday, we're traveling up to Manchester because we have another Halloween event and that's going to be with the Manchester crew. And I haven't really met any of the Manchester crew apart from Kieran. So it'll be nice to like meet them all before like I end up flying with them. But yeah, so it's exciting times, but it's also stressful because literally all of my stuff is just constantly moving. But today, oh my God, we were, look, I lost a nail last night as well typical um but the way home was ridiculous it's supposed to take like two and a half hours it took us about five hours because of traffic and we were all hanging and it was disgusting like i feel a bit better now but i felt absolutely disgusting this morning but yeah um thank you for nathan and grace for holding the event 
and i'll keep you all updated oh this hotel has a spa as well so hopefully um we're gonna try and get like we're gonna see if there's any available slots tomorrow oh my god if there is i'll be so happy like i'm dying to go for a spa so i've just finished my last flight at birmingham oh my god like i don't know how i feel like it's a little bit emotional but at the same time it's gonna be good for me i suppose it's gonna be a good adventure it's gonna be a new challenge so yeah i just handed back my id done my last flight and yeah tomorrow off to manchester got a manchester party with the crew so that means i can meet them and then a couple of days off and then we're gonna start flying it's exciting but there's a lot to do um so today i've been on an early flight i don't know if i'm gonna nap yet but i definitely need to do uni and then me and mikey are staying in this hotel and it's got a spa so we're gonna go to the spa tonight so that'll be exciting but yeah i just can't believe how quick it's come around like i started this vlog when i was literally like moving all my stuff out to go back to wales and now it's literally happening like oh my god i've arrived in manchester now um i've got the crew manchester crew halloween party tonight and then i'm going back home tomorrow but we're staying in the Wimslow lodge and this is what it looks like like it's really nice but yeah i'm excited i've officially left birmingham now like oh my god but let's get ready massive graze on my knee and honestly it kills like i'm in agony really really hurts but yeah i went to the manchester crew party last night um for halloween and that was amazing um the crew is so lovely like it makes me so excited to start i'm still a little bit nervous but i'm glad i've met some of them I haven't met all of them but i met some so that's that's nice um i'm gonna vlog just this week i'm getting my eyelashes and nails done tomorrow getting my hair done on wednesday which i'm excited about and then my first flight in manchester is on thursday so i'm gonna vlog that to like let you guys all know how that went but then that will be the end of my vlog hopefully you'll all enjoy this vlog though like you can just experience what i've had to go through like with all the stress of moving um i had, do have a week of annual leave though in november which i'm excited for i've got like 10 days off so i can do lots of uni during that week so i feel like i am doing it but i've neglected it a little bit but that's only because i've had so much going on but we stayed in the wilmslow lodge last night and that was actually really nice but i'm not gonna lie like i like the town wilmslow but last night i was like oh i really fancy kebab and there's no there's no like there's no kebabs around there was no mackies nearby like the taxi driver said if he wanted us to go to mcdonald's it would be 60 quid so we're like so yeah we had to go to tesco garage and get a sandwich like who does that after a night out but yeah so yeah this is an update um i'm just on the way back to wales now i'm so excited to go home and see all my family i'm just gonna have a nice chill couple of days and just do uni work so guys okay so i honestly i'll have to be honest now i was meant to vlog after my first week at manchester but things just got like so busy i literally completely forgot and then obviously these are my eyelashes that i got done and they're making my life so much easier and then as for my hair i don't know if you can see in the car because it's literally dark now it's like so much blonder but i think it looks so much better like it's so me um i hate being brown but you know my my blonde had like grown out so i kind of had to just stay like that for a while because i didn't really want to go to like a new hairdressers in um birmingham because like i'm just scared that they're gonna do it wrong so i just wanted to wait till i come home but yeah i'm feeling so much better uh manchester not gonna lie at the start the very first week i hated it i felt like crying it just it was a shock it was very overwhelming but that's only because it's not what i'm used to like i've been at birmingham for nearly four years and obviously i'm used to doing it a certain way and then that way is just completely changed and there's been so many changes like coming back home you know 
got to find my way around the airport again new people so it was very overwhelming at first but now that i'm used to it i actually quite like it um it's a much bigger base and you see so many more crew but i actually like it like i like the vibe of it um and obviously since oh there's a car looking at me what is that car doing oh my god like i'm literally sat in the car with my... it's fine i was sat in the car with my lights on because i'm currently in the car park like i need to go home so yeah um but even though i do miss my birmingham base like because obviously it it was like home to me um good things have happened though being here like from the first of december i'm going to be a permanent number one and it just seems to be that everything this year is just working out even though i've had some really bad times this year overall it's been good things happening so i'm excited to have my promotion and be opponent number one i'll never be at the back galley anymore i'll always be cabin supervisor and yeah so the next step is me and mikey finding a place to live but yeah so everything's good and i hope you enjoyed this moving vlog sorry that like towards the end it got a bit like and organized shall we say but i also have some more exciting news i am also got a camera on the way so my youtube is going to get a lot better and the quality is going to be so much better but yeah anyway thanks for watching and i will give you all an update soon